Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, there's been a video that's gone viral on the internet. Um, it's basically a video showing the proposed design for the latest iPhone. Uh, they've stated that it's going to be called the iPhone HD, and they've also stated that it's going to be the most social iPhone yet. So we'll watch this ad, and then um, basically I'll go over my thoughts, and you guys can just comment below on what you think about the ad, and uh, what you think should be implemented into the new iPhone. So I'll just show you the ad now. Alright, so this is the proposed design for the latest iPhone. Um, obviously, it's Apple, so Apple has never released um, an advertisement for any product before they've actually um, officially stated that it's coming out at a keynote or some kind of event or anything. So I don't think this is an official ad, or I don't know if it's a real design or anything. Um, but if this is, there's some really nice um, design ideas, I guess, as such, that um, I reckon would be really nice implemented into a new iPhone. So um, as you see here, um, there's a camera right at the top. It's hard to see, but there's a camera right at the top there. And uh, that would be perfect for um, video conferencing, video calls, Skype. Um, that would be great for applications, because they could um, implement... I guess videoing yourself into an application for like an avatar or a character model or something or whatever they um, have got in plan for that. Um, down the bottom it doesn't actually look like a physical button so they could um, be trying to implement full touch screen. Um, you know you have the home button on the um, iPhone now which is an actual physical button but maybe this is a um, touch sensitive button that you maybe slide your finger across or something um, or maybe it could be something as simple as um, when you're on the home screen you can slide your finger across this um, touch pad at the bottom and then it'll maybe uh, slide along the um, home screen quicker so that you can get to further pages or something, I don't know, it could be um, whatever really um, there's a few things that obviously make this look like kind of a fake ad so for example, you go back to the beginning, and as you see right here, that is a jailbroken iPhone. I don't think Apple are going to allow um, any kind of customization to that extent at the moment anyway, and that's basically a screenshot from a jailbroken iPhone. Then obviously when you look through the um, interface and everything, it's got the same um, OS running and obviously the new iPhone is going to be running the 4.0 and I do suspect that they will be updating the interface so it's basically the same interface as 3.0 and all that kind of stuff so it doesn't really look like it's genuine in that way but then the ad is mastered extremely well it looks really great um, the iPhone ad kind of shows off kind of a design here as you see. It's got a curved back, it's got a really sleek, nice finish. If I go to the Apple website, you have the Magic Mouse. And um, this mouse is curved, sleek, got the nice silver gloss to it. And it kind of does look exactly the same as this iPhone HD. Um, I really do actually look kind of like the design of it. It's got a really nice um, curved edge finish to it. Uh, it's really sleek and it really looks glossy. One thing is it would scratch hardcore if this was to be the new iPhone. Um, as you see there's only two colours in the ad, there's the black and then just the normal kind of silver. Which I actually like, that it's not kind of like a plastic back. And then the um, nice front and everything, it kind of looks like it's moulded together, like the silver just looks kind of like an aluminium um, full enclosure 
Like on the um, later, on the earlier models, it's kind of like a white background, but this is kind of like an enclosed aluminium body, which is really nice. Um, and yeah, I don't know, like Apple always seemed to like the fully closed aluminium bodies on their Macs and stuff, so that could be a pretty nice um, addition to an iPhone. Um, I don't know really, like, it could easily just be um, a really nice design concept that someone's created and then um, just kind of graphically um, overlaid some kind of video from um, a 3G iPhone or whatever and then just kind of um, positioned it over the design and then tweened it along so it moves when the iPhone moves which would be quite a lot of work but this, this is really well created so it would have taken them a long time to make this um, but then again like as you see with the Facebook it's got the exactly same design as the uh, original Facebook on the iPhone there's nothing really that pops out as new because that's obviously jailbroken right there and it's just, I don't know, it just kind of seems like they've just done this really nice design concept and then just pasted some um, uh, video footage from a 3G or whatever. Um, but then again, it's a really nice concept to the iPhone with the whole camera on the front, this touchpad thing down the bottom, the nice curved finish, the enclosed alum aluminium body. It's kind of, it looks really nice, and I would imagine it would be really nice to hold as well as it's got the curved finish. It would be like you'd fit well in your hand, just like the Magic Mouse. And uh, it does really have a nice concept there. I'm really liking this uh, concept of the iPhone HD. Um, as it is called, the iPhone HD, if this is going to be real, yet again, this is a rumor, so it might not even be called the iPhone HD, it might not look anything like this or whatever, but if this is going to happen and it's going to be called the iPhone HD, that could imply that they're going to have a higher intensity um, screen, maybe like an OLED or um, something even stronger than that to just bring out the vibrant colours and everything and just make it even more pleasing on the eyes. Um, it could mean that they're going to try and implement more social um, elements because um, obviously social networking and all that kind of stuff is massive nowadays. So they're trying to, I guess, bring it into um, the age gap, the age gap um, nowadays, like all the teens and everything, even though it's already kind of targeted at that anyway. It's kind of targeted at a wide demographic of like any age, but maybe they're going to try and focus this on a maybe a younger age gap, I'm guessing. But then again, I wouldn't have a clue what this could mean. It could just be an, a really well mastered ad, or this could be some really nice concepts that may be added. But then again, I don't know. So the question of the day today is, what do you think should be implemented into the new iPhone? Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, comment below on what you actually think about this ad, um, what you think about my feedback, and what you guys think will be implemented into the new iPhone. Um, make sure to subscribe for any updates on the new iPhone, the new iPhone firmware and anything tech related. Um, make sure to rate 5 stars and please subscribe and comment below. Thank you for watching.